today is a very special battle between the boys and the girls. <laughs> Sounds to me like there's a lot more girls in the audience today. Congratulations to the four you brainiacs for making it to this level. Let's get to know you guys a little better. Elliot, yeah. you are leading the whole time in level one. Yeah, I'm going to win the whole thing. That's Woo! what we're talking about. Nice job, Elliot. Clara! Hey. Staging a huge comeback there, going into oh, the last no. puzzle. No points. Tell me about that. That was kind of really scary, because if I went down the branch and with zero points, that would have just been pretty embarrassing. But now you're here. And it's all good. There you go. And the girls seem to love it. Nuri, it says here you're a competitive cheerleading. Yes. All right, and you got some splits you can do? And wow. yes. Brendan, you're a baseball player. What position do you play? Pretty much anything, but I mostly play catcher. Mostly play catcher. I uh, think you can hit a home run for the guys today? Oh, yeah. All right, enough chit-chat. Let's get to the game play. Level two. All right, guys, as of right now, the Boys versus Girls Challenge, or as I like to call it, the BVG Challenge, is evenly matched. In this level, I'm gonna tell you guys a story from my big book of truth on your feet. It's story time. I want you to pay close attention to everything you're about to hear and see. And remember, everything I'm about to tell you is 100% absolutely true. Every year, my family has a reunion. I'll never forget the one we had at the park. It was all grandma's idea. The family that plays together stays together. If your family's like mine, you probably have relatives like my Uncle Ed. What you got there? Whose breath is so bad it could make a frog croak. My Aunt Janice loves slapping people on the butt. My cousin Vanessa has a bigger mustache than a video game plumber. Grandpa loves showing off his gallbladder scar. X marks the spot. Everyone asks me the same question. What grade are you in? Tenth. Honey, what grade are you in? Still 10th. Fantastic! Please don't slap my butt. Uncle Ed had an allergic reaction. Ow! Ow! Got it! Let's see the scar. We made a human pyramid, but we never should have put Cousin Bernie on top. Or Grandpa on the bottom. That's gonna leave another scar. But the highlight was the tug of war. I guess Grandma was right. The family that plays together stays together, especially when there's mud involved. That's my story, and it's all 100% true. All right, you guys know how to play. Elliot, I'm coming to you first. Aunt Janice is known for slapping people on what body part? The butt. The butt. Let's find out. That sound means you're right. Yeah, Elliot. Clara, my uncle Ed had an allergic reaction to what insect sting? A bee. A bee. Ding means you're right. Murray, over to you. What kind of ball did Grandma throw at the beginning of the story? A football. A football. Let's find out. You got it. Brendan, yeah. you ready for this? What game caused most of us to fall in the mud? Tug of war. Tug of war. Sit and hold. All right. Everybody's in it. T-shirts are at stake, guys. What cousin was on top of the human pyramid? Cousin Big Joe. Big Joe sitting hold. Oh, no, Elliot. That sound means you're wrong. Clara, same question to you. What cousin was on top of the human pyramid? Cousin Guzman. Cousin Guzman. Oh, no, it was not. Cousin Guzman did not make it to the family reunion. It was actually Cousin Bernie. All right. Well, here we are, guys. Evenly matched again. Boys versus girls. Everything rides on you two. Knockout round. Nuri, you are playing for the girls in the audience, as you know. Brendan, representing the boys. How about it, guys? They sound like they want the t-shirts, buddy. Behind those numbers are pairs of images from the story you just heard. Make a match correctly, you stay in the game. I'm going to give you guys 10 seconds to memorize the board, and that time starts right now.
Time is up. Okay, here we go. Nuri, we're going to start with you. What is your first number? Two. Two. There you go, it's a match. Brendan, over to you. Nine. Nine is his first number. And ten. And ten. And the boys are still in it. Pressure back to the girls' team. What's your first number? Four. Four. And? Fourteen. Fourteen. That's a match as well. Brendan, how about it? What do we got? Three. Three. And? And... Six. Six. Not a match. Okay. The girls could take the t-shirts right here. We're in sudden death territory. The next correct match is today's Brain Surge champion, and their team is getting the t-shirts. Nuri, what's your first number? Three. Three. And for the win... Twelve. Twelve. T-shirts, you're going to the next level where you could win thousands of dollars in prizes plus a sliming you're never going to forget. Let's see what Elliot, Clara, and Brendan made for making it this far. Congratulations! You won a pair of Southern California City Passes! Southern California City Pass includes admissions to Disneyland, Universal Studios Hollywood, SeaWorld, and San Diego Zoo. City Pass saves!